What did you think about uh, the quarterbacks of the summer? I guess in terms of leading workouts. I mean, I, I know I know you're not going to decide who the starter is. I guess first of all, what did you think of Cole Kelly's summer? Uh, Cole had a pretty good summer. All the quarterbacks had a good summer. They, you know, they all worked hard. You know, they all showed great leadership, which is important. And you know, uh, having a quarterback with great leadership is always is always a good thing for the team. And you know, that's they all showed that. So they all did a pretty good job this summer, and they're still doing a good job. What do you think about Ty's summer? Ty, Ty story, yeah. pretty had a pretty good summer as well. You know, he led he led vocally and led by example. And you know, that's all you could have asked for in, as a quarterback. Cole uh, lost 20 pounds. I guess he was tweeting about that the other yeah. night. What, what do you? Th- I mean, do you see Cole moving different? I mean, how's he different at 255? And I guess he was at 270 something. I mean, not just moving different, but he looks different. You know, he he looks a lot different, and you know, it shows how hard, shows how much work he put in. It shows that he bought in as well, and it's just it's, he made a drastic change, and it's not just better for him, but better for the program as well. So. A bunch of the offensive linemen trimmed up or some, and like I guess, guess in the case of Wagner, added weight. What do you think of the way the, the offensive line kind of transformed those, uh, those guys transformed themselves over the summer? They all look great. All offensive linemen look great. They worked their tail off this summer, and, you know, they're, they're continuing to work hard, you know, so, I mean, so we can have a good season. How impressed are you with what they did, the, the buy-in factor? It's not easy to lose a lot, a lot of weight. This year. You, I mean, yeah. you did it too. You know how hard it is. What do you think of those big boys up front doing it? I, it was hard for me, so I know it's extremely hard for them. You know, not not being able to eat what you want all the time, but you know, at the end of the day, it, it's worth it. And and at the end of the day, it's going to help you become a better player. Just how, how deep is that running back room that you're in? Oh um, man, it's it's, we, it's it's pretty deep, but we have a great room. You know, each of us brings something different to the table. You know, we all make each other better. And you know we're we're brotherhood, so we're gonna to continue to work hard and just just grind and make each other better each and every day. Thanks, man. Compared to the previous staff, how does this staff approach the running game? What's different about it? Uh, well, obviously more open, more more open space, uh, RPOs, more RPOs. Um, just just having a better chance of running into, running into more space. You know, with the spread offense and stuff like that, and also having a lot of different options you can do, not just run the ball, but quarterback can pull or he can throw the ball, you know, things like that, and and, and yeah, that makes your offense real dot, real versatile, and and hard and harder to stop. So you know, with and with the running game, you know, it's, it's just a lot better for, I mean, just all around.